This is DC Danton Crow Crusader. It's the 8th of November. Uh, here's our little gulls. And we have a few crows already in the field and ducks. Um, you see they're all different ends because I throw down the food uh, in different uh, areas of the feeding station. Unfortunately, uh, Mr. Fatzer is here today, but uh, believe me, I'm in no me mood to take his shenanigans. So we'll just move on with our work here while he's doing his work, okay? I guess we're doing fall cleanup. Anyway, it was a beautiful day today. Really a beautiful day. Few clouds. But uh, but basically a very, very nice, beautiful fall day. Unfortunately, how many ducks do we have here? I see three females, one, two, three, four, five, five males, and uh, three females, mother ducks. And there's our little crows, and a few pigeons. Put extra green in here tonight. After seeing how many ducks were showing up, uh, We'll put our food down right here. There they go. Well, we can't help that. They'll, uh, they'll come back. Of course, there they are making noise there at the shopping center. Well, what else is new, right? Just right on cue, right? Anyway, put a little nut down here. Still this cold, but the 8th of November, I mean, we have to have winter sometime, don't we? Uh, really can't complain. It was a very warm and beautiful fall. So, this out here, we got uh, some walnuts. I think they're making noise over there. There it is. Janitor's gone. Mr. Garrett Schmidt is gone. See if our little ducks come back, I'm not sure. Anyway, but we do have uh, our gulls here. A little larger group, because it's the evening, right? A little larger group. We'll see if Seymour shows up. I don't see Seymour. I think he was here this morning. Not 100%. I thought I saw a silver gull. Anyway, we'll put this out here. Who's making all that noise there? Uh, a pigeon. All right. Any little things here? unbelievable every time it's quiet when I first arrive and then they start in it's just unbelievable looks like Fasser has brought a few people with him today another young man what in the world are they looking for there that is the foundation of that little building that they had there. It looked like a, a square egg. They've never replaced it. They just leave that uh, foundation there. I'm not sure what's going on. And they had a little terrace and they planted little fig trees. And look, look how many there are now. And somehow they're just leaving them there. Believe it or not, they're surviving, those little fig trees. This looks like another maintenance person over here. Gosh, how many people does he have here today? I'm not sure. Anyway, here's our little gulls, our black-headed gulls.
and, uh, and our little crows and a few pigeons. Crows are competing with their little black-headed gulls, but they had, uh, they had good treat this morning. So it's a little bit after four o'clock, well, maybe 10 after four, uh, sunset. Sunset is about uh, after five o'clock, but it's making its way pretty soon. Sunset will be at 4.30. It's, in other words, at four o'clock, it's already too late out here. It's already dusk. So um, yeah, we'll have to be out here much earlier. Anyway, so far, Fatser is quiet. He's not saying anything, the gar gardener of Hayfleet. Um, see how long he can contain himself uh, and then the other residents here who see fit to honk their horns and harass the birds so but anyway uh, right now it's relatively quiet even at Migros let's do a head count of our crows About 30, 35 crows. Down, down to what it used to be. And I think you noticed that on your videos. Um, I don't see Seymour here tonight. Don't know why he's not here. I think he was here this morning, but I'm not 100% sure I have to review the video when I upload it tonight. Uh, thank you all for your very nice comments. Uh, any feedback on my uh, idea about a film, documentary on the life and death of Charlie? Um, and, and basically, uh, the life of Charlie is about this feeding station, isn't it? Right? It's about this whole project here. Uh, and Charlie was just another victim of the uh, very, very evil people here that hate birds in Kreutzlingen. He was also a victim as many other crows and sparrows and seagulls um, have been over the years due to the residents of Kreutzlingen. By the way, I keep going back. I haven't uh, written back to bird life yet. Uh, I, will, I will do that, uh, giving them more sp specific details of what's going on here at this feeding station. But uh, they said that they have received complaints, many complaints in the past of poisoned birds, and it has been a problem for decades here in Kreutzlingen, along with other poisoned animals like cats. There have been more than a higher percentage of poisoned cats. Uh, if you compare the data in other parts of Switzerland, and here is exceptionally high. I don't know what's going on in this city. I really don't. And anyone, th this is the data from the World Wildlife uh, Fund Foundation, okay? Um, they, uh, they provided that data with a reporter who has someone here who's living in Kreuzlingen, and that's through their observations. I mean, how do you gather the data except through uh, observation and documenting it, okay? Like I've documented it. Almost 1,300 videos of documentation. Uh, over uh, over close to a two year span, okay? More like a year and 10 months or whatever. Um, and before then, I had a written diary. So how else do you document except through living through it and uh, observation and, and being part of it? So that's, that's where the data comes from, okay? Uh, Anyway, I see 
one silver girl there, but it's not uh, a mule girl, sorry, mule girl, but not Seymour. Anyway, this is DC Danton Crow Crusader. I wish you a great Wednesday. Of course, hopefully, employees are still working as they should be. And uh, we wish you a great uh, Wednesday. Love your birds. Take care. And we will see you. We will see you tomorrow. Fatser's talking to himself, which he occasionally does, okay? He's, um, as they say, not the sharpest tool in the shed. Uh, he's got problems. But most of all, he hates birds. And I have no doubt that man that used to visit him in the silver Mercedes bringing uh, some sort of pesticide, fertilizer, geared toward poisoning the birds. Okay, so Mr. Fatzer is not a good person. Okay, anyway, yeah, you may not like my comments about him, but yeah, he's a, he's a strange one. He's, what do they say? My grandmother used to say, he's an odd bird. <laughs> so, um, yeah, perhaps not the best description, but uh, yeah. Anyway, we will talk to you we will talk to you tomorrow. I'm gonna to walk back here and keep my eye on the sky for a few minutes before I take off. This is DC Danton Crow Crusader, over and out.